Hello, it's Janet at Unique Raw Foods and Kitten. You want to see Kitten? He's here. He's here. Up, 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 up. He's meowing. What do you have to say? What do you have to say? Because we're going to talk about some stuff. Mm -hmm. There's two brother. Sister. Walk the way. How are you? Um, thank you for being here. I wanted to show you briefly some time in the kitchen. And to start with some lentil sprouts that have been successful. Here is the top part of, of the juice part of the juicer we're gonna move. Hopefully you're able to see the juicing video and get going on some of that for yourself. Um, just to show you how simple this can be, what I did was take plain lentils. These are the green lentils, you would be calling them. In most places they have the kind of greenish brown husk to them I soaked them in a bowl this big here's a bowl that I used this has water in it from these sprouts draining so I soaked them in here well up to the top um, well overnight, 12 to 24 hours. In a, if it's too hot, then make sure you rinse them. So that water can go out. Soaked them and then to this time, I simply poured them into this little strainer and let them sit there. And then yesterday I rinsed them. No, two days, this is the third day of these. Can you see they haven't gotten green yet? It takes a little while for lentils to get to their green leaf sprout. Usually it looks like by four days. Tomorrow I would say they, a few of them might want to have their little green leaves coming out. Oh yeah, I see one. I don't know, it's not. Do I see one here? There's one. The little leaf coming out. There's my finger. There's the leaf. So they grow however they want, which would be normal for nature. So, and then I would just pour water over here, let it drip out into the bowl. Maybe move them around a bit, as you can see. This time it's pretty cool. They've stuck out some roots out the bottom, the ones that haven't gone to the top. Um, you can dump them out strainer to strainer. And just keep them in one if you want them more mixed up. The key to the whole thing with sprouting, there's a lot of them. But in this simple technique that is so simple and beneficial is that you just need clean water and somewhere to drain the lentils. This could be done with just about any seed. The, fortunately, I have these really great see how fine the strainer is on this um, it, it could handle probably some other kind of seed like broccoli seed sprouts are great radish seeds um, bigger ones are pea sprouts those are fabulous those can be done as microgreens and other microgreen would be a different technique and that is um, sunflowers okay so i wanted to show you this in process these could be used how they are. Um, they could be used to grind up to make raw vegan, like a patty sort of thing, lentil bread. Um, I personally put them into the liver rescue smoothie that I make um, through the medical medium guidance. They're there. 
Benefits of lentil sprouts. Well, I don't have a scientific sheet laid out for you, and I don't really intend to do that for you. Um, what has become confirmed to me as to why I would have them and why I do have them is the life of them, the quality of nutrition that they provide as a living food at this plant. It's not just a protein source. There's a lot more to it than that. They're going to be very hydrating, um, very digestible in many ways. The husk can be uh, something that goes through you undigested. So then, uh, you know, work with your hydrochloric acid, and that does not using any sort of probiotic or definitely not apple cider vinegar or something like that to boost it. I would recommend the celery juice so far. I've seen tangible results with that. So digestibility is going to be good um, for a normal digestion. No digestion is still good. As well as some... B vitamin components, including B12, because the seeds themselves have B12 and they need it to grow, and it is very available um, one way for us to have B12, other than our body getting stronger and starting to make its own, or a high, high quality supplement, very high quality. Okay, so there's that in the kitchen. Sprouts, as you can see, we're by a window that's um, lightly lit, so it doesn't need to be in some sort of bright window corner. Window ledge. Let's see if we want to show outside the day. Can't see the day. It is bright out there. The sky's been bluer these days.